Learners have begun reporting back to school, you may have noticed, for the second term amid concerns over the rising cost of leaving parents who spoke to KBC Channel 1 saying that they have been forced to send their children back to school with incomplete inventories of educational as well as personal effects. Why? Hard economic times. Here's that report. In Buruburu area of Nairobi County, we meet Ruth Mora, a mother of seven, is on her daily business. Mora, just like other million parents across the country, says she's feeling the effect of the rising cost of living. Her children are among those going back to school. Mora says her children will be forced to report back to school minus some essential items due to lack of money. Her sentiments are shared by a number of parents who believe that the odds appear hugely stacked against them. But even as they decry of the rising cost of living, head teachers want the capitation fund increased from the current 22,244 to 30,000 Kenyan shillings per student to bridge a financial deficit. Mora says such demands by teachers post dangers to students whose parents are struggling to make ends meet. It is back to school for millions of learners countrywide. Even as the wheels of learning continues to turn, a fragile economy has seen parents concern on how or when they are going to clear school fees for their children. For Prime Edition, I'm Zainab Said.